hands. Just like that, yeah, great. And then just a reminder to um, wait for the translation for each question and answer before we go to the next question. So just raise your hand, whoever wants to take the first question. Go with Aiden. Harry, um, your teammate Danny Rose described this as a must-win game, uh, especially after the defeats in uh, Milan. Would you go along with that? Is he right? Yeah, of course, it's, it's a massive game in, in the group. Uh, you never want to start with uh, two losses. So um, at home, I think we've got to be strong if, if we want to uh, progress. So uh, it's a big game for us. Uh, but obviously, we, we know Barcelona are a fantastic side, but we proved last year that we can uh, beat the top teams. Uh, especially at home. So, um, yeah, we're looking forward to the game, but we, we know it'll be a big test. In the context of all the injuries you have, how much more difficult is this game? It, it was a big challenge anyway. Yeah, look, it's never great to see your teammates uh, get injured, but um, that's the reason we, we have a big squad and uh, it's for the next man to, to step in and, and do their job. So, um, look, we've got a, a great squad. It gives other people a chance to to impress on a, on a big stage, so I'm sure we'll all be ready for it. Okay, sorry, we've got to wait for the translation, it hasn't, apologies. Y la respuesta, la respuesta ha sido, obviamente, no nos gusta tener tantos lesionados, pero esta es la razón por la que este equipo es tan grande y tenemos otros jugadores que podrán jugar. Yeah, no, it's, uh, it's a great test, you know, uh, as players, you want to play against the, the best players in the world and, and Messi is certainly that. So, um, yeah, he's, he's a fantastic player and I'm sure uh, we'll do our best to, to stop him from adding to that record in, in England. Um, but we, we need to focus on ourselves as well, you know, uh, we've got some great players, we need to uh, play with energy and uh, attack the game. Um, and hopefully, if we do that, we, we can come out on top. Okay, so a question over there. Sí. Yeah. Um, la pregunta es: esta es la primera vez que te vas a enfrentar a, a Messi. Um, si esto te motiva, uh, enfrentarte al mejor jugador del mundo, um, y sobre todo porque Messi ha marcado 20 goles, en la, eh, perdón, en los 20 partidos ha marcado 28 goles eh, contra equipos ingleses de la Champions League. Y la respuesta es, obviamente, eh, como jugador queremos enfrentarnos al, al mejor jugador de, del mundo. Sabemos que es fantástico, pero vamos a intentar pararle. Y también nos tenemos que eh, enfocar en nosotros mismos, um, porque también tenemos eh, grandes jugadores. Y vamos a jugar con, con mucha energía. Yeah, it's important. I think it's important uh, f for us as a, as a team as well to have that belief going for forward. Um, we got off to a great start last season, obviously beating uh, Dortmund at, at home. So um, obviously not so good to, to lose to Inter Milan in this campaign, but um, yeah, we need to bounce back and um, we, like I said, we proved we can beat the best teams around the world uh, and Barcelona are certainly one of the best teams. So uh, we need to, yeah, go with energy and, and win the game and uh, hopefully take that momentum for, for the rest of the, the campaign. La pregunta es, um, respecto a, um, según los resultados de la temporada pasada, ¿cómo es de importante para, para el Barcelona uh, enfrentarse a los mejores uh, Um, ¿Cómo es importante para, para el Tottenham uh, este partido? Y la respuesta es... Uh, um, mm, 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 
Vale, sí, el año partido empezamos muy bien porque ganamos a, a Dortmund en casa. Uh, obviamente este año no lo hemos hecho tan bien, hemos perdido contra, contra el Inter y lo que tenemos que hacer es pues, vol volver a, a, a esta forma que teníamos. Y podemos ganar uh, a los mejores equipos de, del mundo, obviamente el Barça es uno de los mejores equipos y vamos a, a eso, a jugar con, con energía y hacerlo bien. Well, you never know. We'd, we'd hope so, uh, but obviously um, Barcelona might play better than what Real Madrid last season uh, as well. So, um, like I said, we need to focus on ourselves. Hopefully, we can produce that same energy. That was a, a great night for us. The crowd were amazing as well, and that's what we need to to have tomorrow night. Uh, it's going to be, I'm sure, a full house there, and uh, if we can get them on their feet as as soon as possible and create some chances and hopefully take one or two of them early in the game and then that'll put us in a great position um, yeah, for the rest of the night. La pregunta es si, es, si mañana, el partido de mañana um, lo haréis tan bien como el, como el año pasado contra el Real Madrid. Y la respuesta es, um, espero que sí, pero obviamente nos tenemos que enfocar en nosotros. Eh, queremos que sea una, una noche fantástica. La gente, eh, los fans van a estar súper bien, um, va a estar el, el campo lleno. Y lo que queremos hacer es um, pues emocionarlos, animarlos desde el principio, crear um, oportunidades y aprovechar alguna de ellas para empezar bien. Yeah, well, he's set the standard. I, th I think him and Ronaldo have um, gone above the the normal standard that other people had set in in the years gone past. And um, yeah, when you're scoring as many goals as as he is, and um, 40, 50, 60 goals a, uh, a season uh, as a striker, I want to try and match that and try and. Uh, do the same. So, um, yeah, he's definitely set the standard for, for the rest of us. Um, and he still is. He's still scoring scoring goals. So, uh, for me, it motivates me to get even better and improve and and hopefully one day, uh, yeah, score score as many, if not more, than, than what he has. La pregunta es, si mañana marcas contra el Barça, será el décimo gol en 12 partidos. Eh, Messi marcó 10 goles en 23 partidos. Eh, ¿Tú miras este tipo de, de números? Y la respuesta es, bueno, obviamente Messi y también Ronaldo han, han puesto el, el listón muy alto. Um, y obviamente me gustaría marcar tantos como marca él, 40, 50, 60 cada temporada. Me encantaría tener estos números. Um, eso ha vuelto a repetir que, que marca este ejemplo y esto me motiva para ser mejor y para, sí, para mejorar. Y espero marcar tantos como Messi Yeah, hopefully a hat trick tomorrow night would be obviously fantastic uh, for for the, me and the and the team, of course. Uh, but look, we'll see what happens, you know. Um, for me, I just need to do my job for the team. Uh, as the cafe says, it's everyone working hard for to achieve the same uh, to the sh same goal. So, um, yeah, look, it'll be great and I'll love every minute of, of it if I take the match ball home. But um, I know it'll be a tough game for sure. And uh, But hopefully, like I said earlier, we can create some chances and take a couple and it, it'd be nice to, to get on the score sheet. Hablando de la, del Mundial, cuando Ronaldo marcó um, tres goles, eh, le preguntaron si, si no le importaría hacer lo mismo, él dijo que, que no, y ahora le pregunta que si Messi marcó el otro día tres goles, si le gustaría hacer lo mismo, y dice, obviamente sería fantástico para mí, pero también para el equipo, eh, lo, hay que trabajar para el equipo, vamos a trabajar muy duro y obviamente sería genial. Um, eh, pero va a ser un, un partido duro y, como antes he dicho, tenemos que eh, crear oportunidades y marcar. Barcelona 
No, I don't. I don't think so. I, I don't like to uh, to watch the opposition defence too much. You know, I'm I'm a strong believer that uh, to focus on my own game and do my uh, play my best, and um, yeah, and then it it shouldn't matter what the defenders do or what they don't do. You know, so um, yeah, obviously Barcelona uh, are going for a spell that they're probably not so happy with, but. Um, they're going to be up for this game tomorrow. It's a different different competition. Uh, they won their first game, and they're going to want to carry on winning and, and progressing the group as as quick as possible. So we need to try and stop that happening. Obviously, we need to bounce back from our result that happened uh, away at the San Siro. Um, yeah, so it's a it's a big game for for both teams tomorrow night. La pregunta es, Barcelona, el Barça, al Barça le marcaron ocho goles en siete partidos y los cinco últimos partidos han sido consecutivos. Um, le pregunta si no ve que la, la defensa tiene, tiene fallos. Um, y, la pregunta, y la respuesta es, uh, intento no preocuparme por la defensa demasiado, prefiero enfocarme en mi juego. Y, um, y es verdad que han tenido una mala racha, pero mañana es una competición diferente, será un partido diferente. Y obviamente ganaron un partido y querrán seguir con, con esa racha, en cuanto nosotros queremos uh, no hacer lo que hicimos en San Siro el otro día. Um, yeah, I guess obviously when you, when you score two goals and you win two 0 uh, people see you as the the star of the show. But uh, I think when you watch the game, there was a lot of battling, a lot of fighting going on. The defence was great, clearing a lot of crosses. So um, yeah, look for me personally, I feel good. I feel sharp. Um, when when you maybe don't reach the standards that you set in other years, people will like to talk and like to. Uh, maybe try and make excuses, uh, but for me, I've been focused, and I know uh, if I carry on working hard and improving, then I'll score goals uh, in in any games uh, that I play. So um, for me, I'm coming off the back of a, a couple of goals on the on the weekend, and hopefully, I can take that into tomorrow night's game. La pregunta es si si vuelves a estar también como cuando es cuando el mundial. Y uh, la respuesta es obviamente está muy feliz con cómo le fue en Brighton y, y dos partidos y otros dos partidos. Um, el hecho de que marcó dos goles y que ha habido um, y que han ganado dos partidos es, es importante. Pero si, si observa el partido también verás que la, la defensa fue muy buena. Eh, personalmente sí se encuentra bien, se encuentra fino y uh, lo que quiere hacer es um, enfocarse, seguir trabajando, seguir mejorando, seguir uh, marcando goles. Y obviamente le gustaría repetir el marcar dos goles como hizo el otro día. Last question from this gentleman here for Harry. Hello, Harry. Um, after the last time John won the last three matches, um, you said that they will uh, want to revenge a little bit after the goals that they uh, they are in Barcelona. You you have been feeling about. Yeah, well, uh, we went through a stage not too long ago where we didn't win in three matches and. Uh, yeah, maybe a little bit of pressure starts to build, and, and you want to prove people wrong, and you want to bounce back as quick as possible. So, I'm sure Barcelona want to do that uh, tomorrow night, and um, it's our chance to, to try and stop them, and uh, it's a chance for us to to win four games in a row. So that would be great momentum for us. So we need to focus on ourselves, and that's what we'll do. La pregunta es uh, que el, el Barça no ha ganado en los últimos tres partidos y si cree que son, se tomarán el partido de mañana como una, una revancha. Y la respuesta es, bueno, no hace mucho tiempo que nosotros hemos tenido el mismo problema, teníamos un montón de presión y uh, lo que suele pasar en este tipo de situaciones es que quieres um, hacerlo lo mejor posible. Y seguro que mañana ellos lo querrán hacer muy bien.